Hi, I'm Tom Tracy, a senior tax consultant with Wolters Kluwer CCH. In this video, you're going to learn how to export Schedule K-1 information to other returns. In our example, John Smith is a partner in Acme Anvil Partnership. We are preparing both returns and want to export John's Schedule K-1 information to his return. In the partner information for Acme Anvil Partnership, we need to enter the entity type code. Go to the detail and open the section for export partner information. For individual returns, we need to enter the export option and TSJ code. The TSJ code needs to match the code entered on John's return for this Schedule K-1. Enter the client ID using the lookup value button on the toolbar or from a right mouse click. The list is based on the entity type code we entered earlier. Since John has multiple Schedule K-1s in his return, we need to enter an activity number. The program matches on the client ID, activity number, and the employer ID number. If a match is not found, a new activity is created. Acme Anvil Partnership also has multiple activities. To aid in the mapping pro matching process, we can map the activities in the partnership to the activities in John's return. Go to Other, Export Translation of Activity Numbers. Enter the activity numbers in the partnership return. Enter John's partner number and the matching activity numbers from his return. You can find a list of activity numbers in John's return in the government forms on the Entity Activity Report. When the partnership return is complete, export the Schedule K-1 information to John's return by selecting File, Export, K-1 Export to Other Returns. When you open John's return, a dialog box appears informing you a file is ready for import. I'm Tom Tracy, Senior Tax Consultant with Wolters Kluwer CCH. Thank you for listening to this video. For more ProSystem FX tax training resources, please visit our training and consulting webpage.